check this out. Today, I am bringing you guys directly to the heart of LA. This is MacArthur Park. I am in the heart of Los Angeles. MacArthur Park Lake is a pretty scary lake. Just gonna throw that out there real quick. A uh, lot of riffraff, a lot of, uh, lot of hobos. Uh, another thing I want to clarify, when I say hobos and bums and stuff like that, I care about the homeless. I'm not talking smack about them. I don't want you guys to take that as me talking smack. You know, I have mad respect for everybody. Um, you know, when I say hobos or uh, bums, I'm, I'm saying homeless. You know, that's just my way of saying it. I don't have anything against them. You know, I feel bad for them. I help them out whenever I can. But uh, I'm going to let you guys know, I am in uh, the heart of L.A. And this is, this is crazy. This is a crazy spot. There's a lot of people. You can probably see in the park behind me, there's people doing things. They come here on the weekends and hang out. And uh, there's a lot of riffraff. I'll tell you this. There's been a lot of killings. There's been a lot of murders. There's been stabbings. There's been shootings. Uh, there's been fights, uh, you know, carjackings, a lot of that stuff, cars broken into in this area. So uh, it's not the best areas to be hanging out in, uh, but you know what? Uh, I'm, I'm born and raised around down in San Bernardino in this area, and I've been here my whole life. You know, I know when to, uh, when to talk to people, when not to talk to people. So uh, show you the lake here behind me. Uh, I'm not sure. If there's fishing allowed here, I don't think there is, but I'm just gonna magnet fish until, uh, until somebody tells me I'm not allowed to magnet fish. So we'll see what happens. But uh, I'll show you some clips. I'll put some clips of uh, Los Angeles, deep Los Angeles here, uh, in a couple uh, during the video. And uh, you got to do a little dose. See what uh, the heart of LA is, what the heart of LA is all about. So, uh, see you guys in a second. Let's go see what we can get. <laughs> Very interesting, this. I don't know what this is. Some sort of water valve for something here. Get to cranking on this thing. I wonder if it uh, lets water flow down into this manhole or something. I wonder if there's fish in here. This water looks terrible. There is trash in here everywhere and slime and gunk. I'm already seeing a pair of pants in there. Oh, I see a helmet right there, it looks like. I wonder if that's a helmet. Well, I, well, it almost looks like a helmet in there and something else. Boy, there sure is a lot of junk in this water. A lot of trash, a lot of crap. I'm liking these little cutouts though. These little cutouts with benches on them, these are cool. Throw my magnet off, I wonder how many people have dropped stuff off of this. They have these all over the lake. Every hundred feet they have one of these little benches that cuts out into the water here you can sit on. Oh man, I'm seeing, oh God. That's looking like bird crap to me. Is this what I'm getting myself into? And broken glass? Oh, looks like somebody lit the can on fire. Oh, you can't really see because it's dark there in the corner. Sirens, helicopters. Welcome to LA, folks. Welcome to LA. Boy. Oh, right away. I, oh, God. Oh, sh oh, literally. Uh, yeah, I guess it won't be magnet fishing here. Oh, God. Oh, I see a barrel in the water. Oh, oh, my God. <laughs> oh, this is evil. Oh, I love it. I love exploring like this. That's just great. Just fine and dandy. Oh, God. I'm wondering what's going to come out of here. I'm thinking needles. I'm wondering if I should even be doing this. Hold on. Looks like the bird's been hanging out. Here's another one of these valves. God. 
Oh man, I'm, uh, oh my. Oh my, I'm almost, there's a California's driver's license identification card right there. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's melted. What is that? That looks like an identification card of some sort. Oh my, I'm wondering what's going to come out of here, guys. There's a bicycle frame right there. I see it. I could probably pull that out. I see a bike frame. It's right up and right of that white piece of paper out there. It's over here too, you know? Oh, the tingas, huh? A metal? Oh, that turtle. Tortuga. Tortuga. Yeah, the tortuga, huh? Here is a... That looks like a bitchin' cart, a flat cart with wheels. I'm wondering if I can get that out, throw that in the truck. Oh my god, look at all this metal. This is just, this, I can't believe. I can't believe this. This is just, there's signs, there's metal, there's trash, there's everything. If I throw my magnet in here, I'm gonna be pulling out all kinds of crap. I can't believe how, how bad this is. There's a, a, a scoop for a, a broom. There's other metal in here. That, that's just amazing. I'm wondering if I should be throwing my magnet in here. I'm gonna try another spot and see what, see what it looks like. I'll see. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. God. Old boy's laid out under the bench, poor guy. He's getting a little shade, I guess. I wonder if he's living down here. That's probably the case. Please, no wading or swimming, private boats, or any floatable objects. Yeah, wading or swimming, I think, is probably out of the question. I think you'd have to be out of your right mind to... This looks like P Central here. Oh my goodness. Wow, these benches, these pop-outs are terrible. Oh, this is terrible. There's a radio. There's a boom box right there. Boom box radio. This is, oh man. Oh, I'm sorry for you guys having to see this. This is embarrassing. This is just plain embarrassing, all this junk out here. You know, Los Angeles can be beautiful. But not when people just throw every piece of crap they want to get rid of this place. Yeah, there's oh boy, he's laid out. Looks like the seagulls like to hang out here. Uh, I just, I can't believe this. Oh, I see baby guppies, fish swimming around in there. That's sad. That is just sad. There's a notebook of some sort. Somebody just threw out there a book of something. Guinness Book of World Records. There's a car jack. Right to the left, up and to the left of the Guinness Book of World Records, there is a full-on car jack. There's another bike frame. There's a valve key, metal water valve key. There's another bike frame. Oh my god, all this trash. This is, this is crazy. Uh, I'd love to send this to like the city of Los Angeles, this video, and be like, hey, yo, what's going on with this lake, guys? That's terrible. That is just terrible. And these poor birds, beautiful birds, sitting here digging around in this toxic water. That's just crazy, guys. I can't believe this. More metal, more junk. I think I'm not even going to throw my magnet in here. I don't want to throw my magnet in here. I don't want to touch this filth. There's another barrel out there. 50-gallon barrel. Probably an old trash can. 
Oh my god, yep, there's trash everywhere. There's the cops up there probably stopping somebody for vending. No license trying to sell things out of the back of their car. They're up there giving somebody hell. Wow. I'm scared. There's a comic book just floating. How are you going to throw a perfectly good comic book in the water? Maybe it blew in there. Who knows? Junior was reading it while they were waiting for the bus. Uh, well, there's a full-on chili pepper next to a plate. Meal in one over here. There's another chili pepper. Big old Serrano chili or something. Wow. This area just smells like nothing but piss. Excuse my French, but it smells like pee. And this might just be a, <laughs> this might just be a uh, non-magnet fishing day at this lake. This might just be a, a check out this nasty lake video. There's a full-on carpet. I don't know if that's a needle or not down in there, but that's a full carpet, a rug. Somebody just threw in there. I'm wondering if there's guns and knives in here. I bet there is. I bet there is. I bet they're out there as far as somebody could throw them, though. There's a heater, a little electric heater that somebody would use at home. I don't know if you guys can see this stuff, but I'm thinking you can. There's a bunch of other crap, chains and what is that brass? What is that brass thing? Is that a fire poker? That must be like a fireplace poker. Brass. That might be worth something to use for my fire pit if it's not too dirty. I'll have to hit that hit it with my magnet on the way back if I even decide to get my damn magnet wet here. There's more electronic devices in there. Kids' toys, cars. Other crap in there, beer cans, signs. That's crazy. That is just wild. Every turn, every foot of this lake is full of crap and junk. That's sad. More crap out there. Nice, nice, healthy looking animals out here hanging out. It's real low. Water's real low right here on this section of the lake itself. So, you can see more junk. I bet out towards the middle it's not as bad, but uh, I didn't think I was going to walk this whole lake. I cannot believe this. Can I see my truck from here? It's over by that guy with the red. I guess I can making sure because you never know in this, in this day and age. We got some dudes over here drinking beers. There's nice little you know reeds out there in the middle. The birds are hanging out. It seems like the cleanest spot for the birds. Oh what is that? A chair? A hat rack? That's a Christmas tree. It's a GD Christmas tree. What is that? A Christmas tree? It sure is. It's the base, plastic base and stand, and it's the Christmas tree itself. Yeah, let's go ahead and bring your Christmas tree down here and just throw it on in there. Wow. I wouldn't be surprised if there's a dead body out in the middle of this lake. I'm gonna walk this whole lake, see what I can see. This is wild. I can't see anything over here. I wonder if it's a little deeper. Seems like it's a lot deeper. 
If I'm gonna magnet fish here, I better be close to the truck because I'm gonna end up pulling out a ton of stuff. I don't wanna carry all this stuff way over there. I'm just gonna go walk back around close to the truck, magnet fish some, see what I can get out of there, and, and go from there. So, <laughs> oh, I'm just saying, this, this craziness. There's a whole tire. Yeah, that's real gray. It's real gray, that's sad. That is sad. Well, here is back to the truck. I'm gonna take some throws right here and see what I pull out of here. I'm thinking I'm gonna be pulling out some weird crap, guys. We're gonna check this out right now. I'll see you guys in a second. <laughs> okay, guys. Here it goes. I don't know what I'm gonna pull out of here, but... It's going to be scary, maybe. <laughs> we'll see what happens. This is crazy. So this is the most mixed up bunch of uh, one throw I've ever had before. Here is a set of keys. The key is just deteriorating when I touch it. There is a set of keys there. This is a battery, a watch band, part of a watch band. A huge nut, a flint wheel from a lighter, and some magnetic rock. That's pretty wild for one throw. That's pretty mixed up. This is in an old bungee. I've got a an old clasp of some sort. This is a piece of metal that's completely rusted. Here's a spoon. <laughs> now this is interesting, so, uh, <laughs> um, I have this thing, whatever this is, it's some sort of tool somebody used to pry something off with, uh, this here is a,
That's an earphone, an earbud, some headphones. I can see how that could hook onto the magnet. Now this here is one of those devices that they hook to, is it or is it not? Maybe this is something else. Let me get a look here. Dreamcast. Oh, this is some sort of uh, wireless device. Looks like it's got USB and Ethernet uh, connections on it. I swear, if this some of this goes in my mouth, you guys just might see me throw up. <laughs> oh, because that is just—it's nasty. What's up guys? Probably extremely loud right here. I'm gonna have to do some editing on the sound. This video is probably gonna sound a little funny. But uh real busy street right here. Los Angeles, of course, all the streets are busy, crazy. Uh, have some crazy, crazy finds today in the lake. MacArthur Park Lake. It's right here in the heart of Los Angeles. Can't get any closer for a lake in Los Angeles. We got buses coming by. Really, no quiet spot here to do this. You are here with the heavy metal magnet, and I am going to show you some killer finds. Crazy stuff today. You saw the beginning of the video, you saw all the different crap that we spotted in the water. I wasn't even going to attempt to try and pull all that stuff out. I would have had a truckload. I am going to come back though because I do want to find that one special something so we'll see I'll make another trip on another day but um, overall four hours magnet fishing I pulled out a bunch of stuff I think you guys are gonna trip out on what I pulled out of here and I only did I only did 50 feet maybe a hundred feet from over here to over here that's all I did I didn't even go anywhere on the other side of the lake or nothing so if I was to do that I would definitely be pulling out all kinds of crazy stuff I'll save that for another day. <laughs> so, let's get to the finds. Okay, finds for the day. You guys are gonna trip on this, let me tell you. There's so much stuff here, it's gonna blow your mind. And this was, like I said, only a 100 foot stretch of the edge of this lake. Crazy. So, First off, a mouse for a computer. A mouse for a computer, crazy. Hooked up on that. Hooked up actually on the end of this. Pulled that sucker in on the end here. And a little USB cable end. We've got some headphone. It's like headphone buds, earbuds for headphones. Pretty wild, a spring. Some sir clips, other clips. Here we have nuts, bolts. It's gonna be kind of loud for this finds video because I'm right on the street. So I'm gonna try and talk as loud as I can and I'll try to edit the video best I can for it. There's a lipstick case, nuts, bolts, fisherman's bell. This is a pile of batteries. That must be 50 batteries. Triple A's, double A's, nine volts. C's, D's, watch batteries, all batteries, crazy amount of batteries, every throw, 
was like two batteries. Every toss, two batteries, 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 batteries. That's terrible. If I was to magnet fish this hole around this whole lake, I'd probably pull in so many batteries. It's just disgusting. Poor fish and poor turtles and birds. It's just terrible. These heavy duty pieces of steel, I found this here as well, hooked up on that. All kinds of little stuff I pulled out today. Here's half a harmonica. Half of a harmonica, that was crazy. A little clip, some little welding clip or clamp. These little uh, pair of tweezers that came apart when I found them. This is like a nail digger, so you dig under your nails or something, who knows what that is. I think this is the only good one out of here. I'd probably clean this up and use that. Still looks fairly new. I found a Starbucks coffee shop key ring, plastic key ring. Keys for days. This is pretty cool. This is an old, ho uh, an old hotel key. Probably one of these old hotels that are uh, right in town here. Somebody probably threw that in a long time ago. Old hotel key. No number on it. Car keys. Lock keys. More house keys. This key just fell apart when I touched it. It just crumbled. Must have been in there for a long time. Found a lock and a key on one pull of the magnet. I figured maybe those two go together. Maybe they were thrown out there together. Who knows? Found a small flashlight. Mini LED flashlight. That thing's shot. Here's another little mini LED flashlight. The flashlight on the end. Mini LED. That thing's shot. Pressing here. Turns on. Found a wine bottle opener. Probably clean that thing up. Wine bottle opener, huh? Trippy. This decorative necklace, cheap decorative necklace, I think that was hooked to something. Found a Memorex radio, little AM FM radio, probably plug your headphones into that, clips in your pocket, get all the AM FM channels out here in LA, rock and roll. Ball jar lids, a couple ball jar lids, screw on jar lids. This was a Dreamcast Ethernet cable, USB something, probably hooked up to a computer or some sort of phone device, hooked up on that. Found a Zippo, cool find today. Old Zippo, wonder how long that's been in there. Got a couple of Zippos myself. It'd be nice if that cleaned up, but I doubt it. Couple of steak knives somebody probably used for fishing or killing, who knows. This is a blade of a knife. Just the blade itself. Saw blade, spoons, forks, a bent fork. This one looks like maybe somebody bent it with their mind. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, but that's how that was. Nail clippers, toe clippers. Half of a VHS tape was hooked to something. I don't know how that was metal, a spoon or something behind it hooked up to pull that in. Probably some old classic film or something. Found an old stiletto. Looks like to me, I don't know how I hooked up on that. Must have been the heel was metal. Maybe it's like that other video where I hooked up on the heel or the stiletto itself. That's probably what happened. This is to a electric to an electric grill or a gas butane grill you can cook on. This is just the guard for it, you know, caution, burner, yada yada. An old belt, leather belt. Pieces of pipe, pieces of metal, conduit, bent metal, all kinds of pipe, a chair leg top of a chair pulled out this is a bike pump this is headphones here throw that with the mouth get some electronics sold out here while I'm out here <laughs> Just get uh, some headphones looks like Apple headphones or something those were in there this is a bike pump hooks to a bike pump that was out there hooked up on that huh 
bungee cords, two bungee cords. One bungee cord was hooked to the end of the other one. That was a trip. And then miscellaneous stuff in the bucket. Miscellaneous things in the bucket, uh, bottle caps, nuts, bolts, all kinds of stuff. This year, I believe, I believe there was probably another side to this, and it was maybe you lay your fish across it for your barbecue, and then you, if with another side like this, on top of this, on top of your fish, I don't know, you hold your fish and you can spin your fish and cook it. That's the only thing I can think it is. Because I don't know what else that would be for a fan, uh, a net, who knows. So, um, pretty crazy finds today. All kinds of crazy stuff. I mean, trip out on this stuff. It's just every throw, every throw, every throw is just something, something. It's pretty trippy. All right, guys, check it out. We are on Alvarado. While I'm down here at MacArthur Park Lake doing my magnet fishing, I figured why not check out some tacos. We're going to check out some of these little shops across the street. There's a lot of vendors selling lots of different stuff. We're going to cross the street here and uh, see what we can find. Yeah. See you in a second.
according to the meter, it's time for me to get out of here. So, it's looking like I got a couple minutes left. Thanks for coming by and watching my video, guys. Remember, Heavy Metal Magnet, please like and subscribe to my videos. Click the bell, get the notifications. Do not forget, you'll see all my up and coming adventures for magnet fishing. I want to do a shout out as well, all my friends in the UK. We got Magnet Fishing Addiction, Raven Girl, Gary Ghost Hunter. Check him out. Like, subscribe, check out the Magnet Fishing World. It's awesome. So I will see you guys on the next adventure. Thanks for joining the Heavy Metal Magnet. Ha, 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 ha.